there way back in the day had been cultivating those ramps, you know, because it was like right near the house and the nice uh, slope. And, um, yeah, that's what I think of a lot of times. It's like I assume that because someone's selling ramps by the hillside that they went and just like dug up someone else's patch, but that's not always the case. Could be a place where people were attending them and they that's just were digging up their own gardens. But when they're selling ramps by the side of the road somewhere. Yeah. Like I, I often had kind of like this I don't know. I hated on those people. But then I heard from someone, oh, I just take those ramps and I plant them in my yard. Because they're like roots and all. Like the, what they're harvesting is like, I think, too much. Like for the flavor, there's so much flavor in the ramp greens itself that so you don't really need the root. Um, rarely do I like harvest and dry out the root. If I'm harvesting the root, I'm probably transplanting it somewhere. And I do think that it's good to like, Grab a leaf or two and let me go. I think it's kind of up to like people and observing things over time. And I don't like the possessiveness of the patches and stuff. I was like, oh, I'm keeping this secret. And I'm like, well. Oh, telling people about my patch and then hopefully that patch will get bigger because they're planting the roots out somewhere else and in a similar zone in a similar aspect. Will you teach me how to do it? Um, how to dig it up and plant it? Sure. How you stop to do it in That means you did something good. Connecting that mind body spiritual experience. You're embodying the cards. What what cards did you, did you pull today? I didn't bring them. Ah, awesome. Yeah, I think it's good to leave work at work and well, I just, I thought about it, and I kind of checked in about, like, what, you know, would Matt want to play with the cards, and I kind of felt like it was unnecessary. I think that we have enough to talk about without cards, which isn't true with everybody, you know. They kind of need that to bounce off ideas and get To talk down. to you? They need to cards talk to talk certain, to you? To talk about a certain depth of something, a certain level, you know. But you and I, no, we don't need that. We just go right for it. Just go right for it. <laughs> um, and I
Roddy Blue has this nice green stain on it. Shows that maybe there's some mycelial action. Mycelial action got up in there. That oh, looks good. Looks good. It's a. Uh, what is it? What does it mean? Fashion over it function. As a, as a fashion tool. over function. Oh, it's just. It's gonna be weaker. It's just gonna be weaker. So yeah, so I'm saying. But more fashionable. Yeah. Uh, mainly just because it was the stick that was right there next to me. <laughs> it was it was the first thing I got. And yeah, maybe it'll break. This is hurting my hand. Yeah, I don't like that. Yeah, I had I had one well a couple of different reasons because So I look for a cluster. Mm -hmm. Couple of three all together. Just add a cluster for the board. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it up. It's pretty rocky here. So I use my hands. Try and get as much dirt and roots as possible. So a few of them, and I'll just separate them out and place when I'm planting it's three different ones. I'm gonna put some root, some leaves in there. Put them in my basket. It's a little more protected. Move on. Because we're gonna take it to a totally different spot.
probably see those at this point. These are the old flower stalks, mm -hmm. and there's sometimes seeds still attached. I see one right there. Put them in the ground. Collect them and put them in the ground. Step. It's surprising how deep they are sometimes. Break it off in there. You can. I'm yeah, trying to use my fingers. They should detach from the middle pretty easily.
Thank you.